puffy stickers. This is just a stupid video, just mainly because I saw one on YouTube that a guy was talking about puffy stickers. And I have a sticker collection and I've kind of gone through and it, my daughter's about turning three. I've kind of introduced her to stickers and I've pulled out ones that from my books as a kid that I've had and I kind of give them to her. Don't have to buy stickers. I already have a ton of stickers. <laughs> I don't know. My, my aunt used to send me a bunch of stickers. My parents would give me stickers. I don't know. I guess it's a cheap hobby, right? And when you're a kid and you think it's cool, I have these old photo books that I would put them into, you know, that would have the plastic here. So I don't, hey, you know, here's, I mean, these are, if you want vintage stickers, these are some vintage stickers. Obviously these are kind of going on the, I'm going to guess Halloween theme there. And then we have classic. We got Puffy He-Man, Battle Armor He-Man. Remember him? Actually had him. And then we have uh, She-Ra. Princess of Power. Oh, Tila? See, I don't even know. I don't remember. I guess it wasn't Shira, it was Tila. And then the original puffy Star Wars stickers. Mm, can we see that right there? Might have to just zoom in. Because I don't have this in my hand. Thought I'd use the tripod for once. 1983. Look at that. I got freaking, you know, there's the Ewoks. Obviously, that was, what was that? Episode 6? Oh, I don't know. Some Star, or Star Trek. Yeah. <laughs> Some Star Wars person's going to get on my case. Sorry, I don't remember which movies was which. The originals were good. Newer ones, I thought, kind of sucked. Anyways, that's just my personal opinion on that. Look at this. I got Easter puffy stickers. No, I'm going to just take this out of the tripod. Try to get fancy and use a tripod for once. And it's not really working for this. Got just some silly ones here. 83. You know, I kind of like lo looking at the years of these. As I said, I'll just flip through real quick. See, my father used to do a lot of traveling back in the day. So, you know, shirt and hotel there. You know, Golf Hotel, Bahrain. <laughs> P.O. Box 580. Look at that. Golf Hotel. wonder if it's still there. We got the uh, a flexible flyer. And, of course, my father was with the government. We got the his telephone's not secure. Don't discuss classified. Some other real cheap stickers. My aunt, my aunt used to send me sheets of them, so I used to get sheets of stickers. Another telephone one. You know, just more. Ah, cut off the bottom. Colorado, I can tell it says Colorado Springs. Well, I now live just north of Colorado Springs. So that's freaking funny that stickers used to be printed here. I've seen that in some other ones, too. Fasten seatbelt, National Safety Console. Now here's a little motorcycle. Yeah, I was into motorcycles when I was a kid. Hey, my name. <laughs> Personalized stickers. Of course, I didn't stick them on anything. I stuck them right in my book. Yeah, oh, here we go. Birthday Bear Care Bears. I mean, what is it? 83. That's an 83-er. Um, some that came with cereal. <laughs> or I mean, uh, what is that? Ding Dongs? Is that a Twinkie? It says, Fruit Pie the Magician. It almost looks like there's a sticker on the other side. I can barely see through. Well, this is 84. You know, here's some, uh, what is that, Captain Crunch? Frito-Lay. 84. These are 84. There's some motorcycle ones. You know, so that kind of goes with my theme on my channel. So, you know, that's why I like motorcycles. We got the aircraft stuff. Uh, my mother worked for a company for a while, so maybe that came from that. I'm not sure. They, they did helicopters out to the oil rigs when we lived in Texas. These are 83. 
actually gave my dad a set of those. My father worked for AT&T for a bit, so, uh, yep, Houston, Texas. I don't even know what any of this means. Or <laughs> some that were fruit and food. There you go. Election stickers, huh? <laughs> Another at t My name again. Triple A back in the day. You want a vintage Triple A sticker? There you go. Back in the day, you used to have to put that on your car. That was part of your membership for to be covered because I wanted advertised. I belong to Triple A now. You don't get nice stickers like that. And I wouldn't want to advertise I was part of Triple A now. <laughs> Seems like bad drivers hit put those stickers on. Bahamas. Look at that Gremlins, our original Gremlins sticker. See, hey, that was one book. Then we'll go over to another book. More vintage. Vintage Yoda there, 81. And then, yes, the official Star Wars fan club card. Um, I probably was a member, but being a kid, of course, I wouldn't write down it. I member stuff. I was uh, I was part of the fan club for G.I. Joe. I remember that because I had a dog tag. I still have that somewhere. Return of the Jedi. I think. Oh, that's another triple A. Look at that. Texas. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. And of course, more with my name. I, I think my parents always you know, I don't know what it is with parents. And then here's another Jedi Fan Club one. What else we got here? We got Pink Panther. What was that? 81. Yeah, the various Pink Panther. Or at t Happy birthday. Just generic stickers. Hey, Smurfs. Puffy Smurf stickers. Look at that. I got Papa Smurf. Oh, my God. Made in Taiwan, 1980, 81, 81. So that one's 1980 right there. 1980. I wouldn't want to peel it off. Probably wouldn't restick. Care Bears. Never was into Care Bears, but what what year? 83, 83, 83 on the Muppets. Ah, another uh, Smurf, 81. He man, most of the, these ones fell off because I found them randomly when I pulled this back out. But He Man Puffy stickers. Look at that super bike. Honeycomb Kid Bike Power. <laughs> I'm proud to be an American. I think that's a window sticker. That's who my mother worked for at one point. Air West Offshore and Corp. There you go. Just random stickers. <laughs> one other at and cruise ship. My parents took a cruise one year and I had the option I could go with them. No, I was like very young. I could go with them or I could go to Michigan with my grandparents. I, I picked Michigan. The thought of being in the ocean. I didn't, I didn't, didn't like swimming as a kid. <laughs> 83, these fish. And just more random stickers. So, what do we have here? Off-road special, specialties of Texas. Yes, I lived in Texas for a bit, as I said. Oh, here's my uh, membership card for G.I. Joe. And what else we got? I got another Jedi. Had these toys for a bit. Virgin Islands, that's from when my parents did the cruise. That one's a hologram. Eagles, you can see. Um, radio station, I'm guessing probably Texas. Astro World. What year? New Year, they were made in New York. I don't see a year on them, but I can guess what they are. Or probably early 80s, mid 80s. Western. Electric.
And here we go. Really old. Star Trek. Look at that. That's good stuff right there. I thought I found a date on that before. I mean, these are original, so I'm guessing late 70s. Maybe it was different when I saw it, could see the date on, but yeah, that's... And I think that it says Captain Kirk. Yeah, it says Captain Kirk, Star Trek. Child find, Houston Fire Department. I probably got that in school because I kind of remember him doing speeches and stuff on that type of. Now put this in your window. Um, can't read date, but yeah, original. Eighty three on these fuzzy guys, and then these are kind of ones I kind of took out of my other book. I don't know where my other book is. Oh, I gave it to the daughter. That's what I did. I cleaned it out. Anything I wanted to keep. Just do a quick, you know. USS Houston's. <laughs> 75. This is um, actually 1980 Tops. You yeah, used to get these sticker cards. <laughs> oh, Hazard County. County Sheriff, man, 81. That's the back, you used to build the puzzle. That's my name. Then you got the uh, letters for the Star Wars. You know, this is 1980, right here. 1980. And again, you would build the puzzle. Let's see what else. We got the Dukes of Hazard. So 81 on that guy. Again more Star Wars. Anything of interest there? Just more, more Star Wars. Yes, my name cut out for sticker. There's a reason behind that. I'll get to here in a minute when we get to the big one. Bell system, Western Electric. Still has the sticker back. G.I. Joe puffy stickers. Look at that. They are 82. I can still remember back as a kid being asked who the president is and saying Ronald Reagan. And knowing that Swaco, I have no idea. It's just kind of random. Smurfs, 83. Here we go. 1980, that's one big sticker. 1980 there. So actually I have a bigger one than this, but Vote Odette. This was taken out of, out of a big thing. My, my grandfather ran for, I don't know if it was Congress, Senate, some type of government position I, I don't quite remember he he strongly believed like if you did not believe in the politician you should run no he did not get elected but he did run and he had billboard you know he had big posters he had big huge stickers voted it and so my father went through i think and took a bunch afterwards and you know, cut out photo dead or uh, last, our last name so that's why we have those et Oh, look at that, original E.T., 82. Another Smurf. <laughs> we got 81, just some, I guess, kind of like rock and roll looking type stickers. And then these ones, like spaceships. I guess that's why I like spaceships and motorcycles. Anyways, I thought I'd just share my various stickers with you. I don't know. I mean, maybe somebody will find this interesting. Maybe not. But the video I saw had a lot of views. So, hey, whatever. You know, I'm going to ask you to please vote Odette. Please like, subscribe, and check out my riding videos. Thanks for watching.